and welcome to Disneyland day one. So because we can't really remember what day of the holiday we're on, we thought we'd just restart it and do Disneyland day one. The original plan today was we were going to have a little bit of a slower start to the morning um, and not get to the park. Like, well, we're not getting to the park for opening because it opens right now. But because it's open till midnight, so we thought we would want to be there till quite late tonight, do yeah, all the firework shows. Yeah, 100%. But we didn't want to get there like for opening and then be there that late, um, just because we've got a few days at the parks. But I managed to get us a virtual queue for Haunted Mansion, and we're in Warden Group 1, and we've got to be there by 9. Yeah, so they actually called us now. So now we're in a little bit of a rush to get there, but it is what it is. Um, it wouldn't be a Disney day if we weren't in a rush to get to somewhere. 100%. This is Daniel's top for the day. I got it from ASOS for him, with the Mickey vibe, and for me, I haven't got anything officially Disney themed, but I thought I'd wear my spotty dress and it's given Minnie Mouse vibes. And I saw a pair of ears at World of Disney last night. They're just like soft, fluffy sort of ears and they got like black and white spots. And I think I'm gonna buy them today. I do have my ears with me um, that I got from Instagram. I can't remember who got them. I'll, I'll tag them in the video description because I love all of their ears, but I really, really liked this simple pair last night, so I think I'm going to get them today. Me and Daniel are far too old to be getting into cars this slow. <laughs> we're, it's so, we're just so used to our big SUV style cars, and even at home we've got a big car, so having to like climb down onto the floor, we look like a bunch of old people. <laughs> So parking is a similar pricing to Florida as well, normal um, parking is $35, I don't know if you can see it on that sign, and then like preferred parking is $55. So we were wrong yesterday, well I don't think we were wrong, where we were yesterday it said Disneyland parking lot, but that's completely different to where we are today, we're in like a multi-storey today. So I'm not quite sure what that one was that we saw the other day. Um, this car park here is giving me Universal Studios vibes though. Yes. Like Universal Studios in Orlando. Um, but yeah, so it's a completely different car park to where that was the other day. Maybe they've got multiple, I'm not too sure. Or that could have been maybe for workers. I, I don't know, it just had a massive sign saying Disneyland parking lot. So we kind of assumed that's where it was. But then when we come off the highway, there were signs on up on the signpost. Like my, sat nav was taking us a different location but the parking like the signs were saying parking this way so one i don't know where my sat nav was taking us could have been taking us that one yesterday <laughs> and two i don't actually know what that one was so yeah so when you are coming here don't always listen to your car um, maybe just go for whatever the signposts are saying and also that's another thing about our hotel our hotel um is a little bit further out you definitely can only really stay there and have a car if you're doing Disneyland. If you wanted to like walk, I would definitely stay at one of the hotels that's a little bit more local to Disneyland. It only took us literally like nine, 10 minutes to yeah, get here. So it's absolutely fine. But um, if you're not planning on really driving or if you don't want to pay for parking and things like that, don't be looking to stay at our hotel, stay at the ones nearby. But our hotel was really reasonably priced. So the fact that we had a car anyway, we knew we were gonna drive here anyway. So it didn't really bother us. But if that's something that would factor in, uh, make sure you factor that in if it's something that would be an issue for you. Um, but yeah, it's starting to feel really real that we're going to I Disney know, today right. now. And I've decided I'm 100% buying those ears. Um, yeah. Nice. Where are we parking? Oh, we're in Donald's. I think we're going to duck. be in Donald. The duck. The duck. The duck. What's your favourite Disney character, Daniel? The duck. The duck. Good old I swear you called him Donald. Daffy at one point as well. Never called him Daffy. I'm pretty sure you did. Never. Daffy Duck. Never. You did. Here comes this dodgy guy. Huh? I said, here comes this dodgy guy. Not dodgy. You are? What? No, they just wanted to check the GoPro um, and the selfie stick. I wanted to see how far out it stretched. Oh. Uh, like, he said, if you, if you are using it on rides, do not hold it up in the air. Okay. Because one, it will knock the camera and you don't want that to happen. No. Time to get on the Disney monorail. Well, tram, sorry. It is 100% real now.
as we walked in the entrance, she saw the ears. And she got the ears. They uh, hold on. That looks good. That looks good, yeah. Disney World, the characters just roam here. Um, yeah. We need to move out of the way a little bit. I'm literally buzzing. I can't believe you got me. You saw the ears, she got the ears straight away. Yeah, but I knew I wanted to get there. I know, there's no point in waiting. So, are we ready to see the castle? I am indeed. It's literally first time for me. No. Everyone says it's so small. Do you not remember it? No, oh, look, you can see more. Oh, that's awesome. So yeah, we are... We're not going to hang around here too much. I know we want to, but... We've got to get we got our virtual queue. virtual queue for Haunted Mansion. So we're going there now because we are quite late for that, but it should be good. It's a home away from home, away from home, <laughs> if you understand that. But yeah, it is very real, very good. Oh my god, there's um, Jungle Cruise. I wish we didn't have to rush to this, right? I know. It's fine, we'll do Horny Mansion and then we can come out and sort of chill and take it, properly yeah. take it all in. But yeah, it is... So, so good. It's like so the same but different. Yeah, it's weird like that. <laughs> like Jungle Cruise has a five minute wait at home. <laughs> at, my... <laughs> at home, yeah. At In home, Florida. It would, it, that would already be 40 minutes. Yeah. Indiana Jones, 15 oh, minutes. Horny <laughs> Mansion is just it. Cool, wow. This is... Oh, that's Pirates. Pirates of the Caribbean. Do you know, fun fact here, in Pirates of the Caribbean, they actually use real skeletons because they were cheaper than making um, skeletons, like, like fake skeletons. It's also bigger than I thought it was going to be. Yeah? It's everyone will say that's more than it is. Yeah, it's definitely, yeah, I would say it's, it seems very, very large, but probably not as large as Disney World Magic Kingdom. It's all decorated for Halloween. And there's uh, Tiana's. Same but different. This Look. one's so different. It is. Oh, it's awesome. The that you were about to be told began the holiday worlds of old. I know you're curious to see what's inside. It's what happens when two holidays collide. Sometimes alarming. So relax and reflect. Feel free to take pause while we tell you a tale about dear Sandy Claus. Was peaceful, not even a mouse. 
So, so yeah. good. Awesome. And it was just like back in Florida because it broke down a few <laughs> yeah, times. It did, it broke down twice. But well, I don't think it breaks down. I just think they, they help like uh, people with um, lesser disabilities. And, yeah. and... So, how do we get to... So, yeah, we are making our way now to Pirates of the Caribbean because we're itching to do that one. Everyone says that it's like it's like a ten minute ride. Oh, it's awesome! Yeah, I thought it was incredible, and I liked the two different drops that you had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were unexpected. They were. Yeah. Well, the first one you saw, and then the second one you're not expecting. Yeah, no, I, I absolutely I loved that, and I, and 
Pyrus is one of my favourites, but I have to say that one is better. And people are loving the outfit. The amount of people that have come up to me. This one lady was like, do you want to swap shoes? <laughs> So what size are you? Um, now we're going to go, oh, it's gone on the last one. That's Indiana's um, Jungle Cruise is there. Yes, we are going to go to, so Jungle Cruise is there, Indiana Jones is there. So we're going to go to Jungle Cruise, then get some breakfast. Yes, we haven't eaten yet, and it is, what, nearly 10 o'clock? Yep, and we want, and I, I want a coffee. Yes. Tiger, we call him that because Himalayan over there. <laughs> Sometimes Himalayan over there. Oh, those three up there? I went to high school with them. <laughs> She's been standing in that waterfall for about 69 years now. Yeah, you can tell because she has so many wrinkles. I know, she brought me to visit a dermatologist. You know what I mean? You know, I tried doing that once, almost worked. Just kidding, I don't shower. Disbelief. Oh, that's an African bull elephant. You know that African bull elephants have really good memory? I wish I had a memory like that. We are now entering the African belt, the holds of African camps. Oh, a lot of cool animals out here today. We got the zebra in the front. Next to the zebra, we got wildebeest. Behind the wildebeest, those tall things. Those are trees. Anyone like zebra? Who like zebra? All right, don't look over there. That one's dead. You know what, someone told me that zebra were rare. That was a medium well done. Caterpillar. And now look, here it is, the eighth wonder of the world. It's the backside of water! Oh, two, eight! So we are going for the chimichanga breakfast. Yeah, breakfast chimichanga. Oh, you only have the lunch ones now. You okay with that? Yep. So we picked up the break well, to pick up the breakfast chimichangas, but they didn't have them. They had the normal ones, and we're both hungry, so we're just gonna get it and make do. And we're good. We'll try the breakfast one on Sunday. Yeah. Wow. Well. It's like a, um, what it reminds me of? Burrito. Like a pasty. Yeah. Mm, it's well nice. We also went to Starbucks and they are so much cheaper here than at Vegas. Oh, so they, this is $12 for two drinks. The same drinks were costing us like $19 in, in um, the Venetian. Oh yeah, we really enjoy enjoy our. And how much was that? I, I didn't even take notes. Seven. I did say it um, mm. when we just before we picked them up. Seven forty nine, oh. I believe. Each. So so far, how do you like Disneyland? I actually think I prefer the Disneyland Park to Magic Kingdom. Yeah. It's not as busy. You can actually walk down Main Street and see what's going on. You can, That's true. Like, none of the queues have been long so far. It could just be a quiet day. Because I love a quiet day in Magic Kingdom. But so far, like the fact that Jungle Cruise has just been a five minute wait all day. Be careful with that. I know. I just, <laughs> just dropped a bit. Of, don't want to get on my t-shirt. I love it. I think it's really, really good. Um, it's like I say, it's so, so similar to Magic Kingdom, but it's different. Mm. And, I, and I like that. I really do. See that there's a hidden Mickey on the back of that rock, but you probably won't be able to see it on here. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
thoughts on Thunder Mountain? Loved it. Very, very good. It does throw you around a bit. It does throw you around. I actually preferred it more than what I remember from when I was younger. That's good. But I do wish I'd bought my patches because I do feel a little bit icky. So she bought them with her, but just not to the park. Yeah, I completely <laughs> forgot because we was in a rush leaving this morning. But yeah, so now we're going to potentially go over to Indiana Jones. But we also want to just go have a little wander around by the castle because we haven't really yeah, done yeah. that yet. So I think we're going to do that and then Indiana Jones. smell of that popcorn <laughs> it does literally, literally smells but it, exactly the same but it waste to me smells better than it, it tastes smells better than it tastes yeah, yeah. we'll say that but i've missed that smell but like i know it's we said this earlier but it's just so much not as busy here like no. this section in magic kingdom yes, is always heaving and we've we've only explored half the park at the I moment know, we've literally done adventureland and frontierland Is it possible to add an iced water as well, or do we just ask over there? You need to try this, it's really nice. Yeah. What is it? It's a mango and peach mint julep. Mm. And we've also gone for, is it three Mickey beignets? Yeah. Oh no. It tastes like donuts. Yeah. But not. Okay. Two donuts are quite oily. Yeah, yeah. And like dense. These are a bit more fluffy. Airy. Airy. Fluffy, okay. Yeah, yeah fluffy. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> Isn't that nice? It's very refreshing. It's very nice. Do you want to try one of them? See what I mean about how it's donut y but not donut. Yeah. Airy. Airy describes it, doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? Uh -huh. It's like a lighter donut. It's very nice. Nice? Oh, yes. You like your beignets? Love your beignets. And now we are going on Indiana Jones. Yeah, as we were saying a minute ago, I don't think it's that busy here because this is only a 35 minute wait. So it's half past 12 and this is our fifth ride of the day or sixth. Um, yeah, which isn't too bad. And we don't have Genie Plus. So, well, it's not called Genie Plus anymore. It's called Lightning Lane Multi. <laughs> Do it again. For your safety, you must remain safe. I didn't get it, get it again. Seatbelt fastened. 
Vamos já. Yeah. Vamos. 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 That was so, so good. Very good. It obviously had the same track as Dinosaur. Yeah. Um, but I prefer It's the same that. sort of ride vehicle. Well, no, it is the same. It's the exact same, even the track. Oh, right. The right, vehicle's right. the same, the track was the same. Oh, okay. But um, I actually... I don't know. I think I do prefer Dinosaur, in a way, because it has more of a storyline. Yeah. But like you know what you're doing in it. But I... That one didn't throw me around twice as much. <laughs> it's still, it? I, th I think it does. It does yeah. chuck you about. But no, but, it was really good. Yeah, um, thoroughly and enjoyed that. It was posted at 35 minutes, and we literally waited 16 minutes, and we know that because the guy in front of us <laughs> had a stopwatch on. <laughs> yeah, so uh, don't always believe the wait times. I mean, we say that in Florida as well, and it's obviously the same here. Somebody's niece is obsessed with Stitch like, at the obsessed. moment. Obsessed. So, and she's asked us to bring her a surprise home. And there is just so much. We I can know, get what do we choose? Hello. Yes, you there. So nice. Encanto stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. So Daniel's just informed me that the boxes he bought yesterday are the comfiest things he's ever worn yeah. and he needs to go to Walmart to pick up some more. Yeah, and just so you know, I I got a 36 to a 38, was it? Yeah. And that's the correct size. So and I, they're the comfiest boxes he's I ever owned. I tried to, um, you try tried to buy keep, the 34. You keep trying to cling on to that 34 inch waist yeah. for as long as you could. Yeah. I still am a 34 inch waist. At a bush. <laughs> Tomorrowland. Oh, you're startled. So, we're just about to do Buzz Lightyear's Astro, <laughs> Astro Blaster. Who's going to go win? Hmm? Normally is you, to be fair, but... Normally, but just to give his luck for both of us. <laughs> We'll see. Who 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 are we guessing to be number one? We just come off Buzz Lightyear, and I just said it's the first ride that's actually come With into a gift, a gift shop. shop. None of the other rides take you off into a gift shop, which is so unlike Disney. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, who won? You did. Oh, I did. <laughs> surprising as well because uh, every time we do that in Disney World I always lose but yeah good so we need to find a restroom now. Yeah. Time has come. <laughs> has to be done. <laughs> it's a small world. <laughs> We just did a 
is a small world. And another one that I think is longer than a Disney world. Yeah, I think so. I, obviously, I know we're comparing the two a lot, but it's just because of, it's what we're used to. Yep. But I'm absolutely loving it here. I think this park's incredible. That's amazing. So we are making our way back over to... Uh, we're spending half of our day in... Um, Adventureland. Adventureland. We're going that way because we've got a uh, reservation at Cafe Orleans. Yeah, yeah. Um, a lady that I know from the Div, her name's um, Disney Kate. She, when I read one of her trip reports years ago, and they went here and had this sandwich, and her and her family literally claimed it as the best sandwich they'd ever had in their life. So this is because of you, and I'm getting that sandwich today. But we just, just like what me and Daniel have been doing today is just sharing, so we can yeah, just we try a bit like of we everything. We can try more, like because there's so much we want to eat, and we can't eat it all, <laughs> obviously. So we just share things and just have small bits of bit of everything. Bit of everything. <laughs> yeah. Just wanted to say before we went on this small world, we bumped into this lovely old guy. He was about 83. Did he say? Yeah, he said he was 80. He's been coming here since pretty much since it opened. And he's just enjoying his life, like to the full. He literally comes here on his own three times a week. And he so. says he spends the day morning in California Adventure. Then he came over this way for the afternoon. He was just so sweet, bless him. Those of you that don't know, this is. Club 33 for the exclusive member. And it is time for our reservation at Cafe Orleans. So the food has arrived. Look at that. These chips look insane. Mm. It's like a spicy truffle mayo. Oh, we all know how much I like truffle. Ooh, yeah. Good. Yeah. Can't wait to dig in. So yeah, obviously we said before that we were sharing because we like to try as many different foods as possible. <laughs> that face says it all. I don't think you're gonna like it. No? No, no I'll just stick to my coat then. Did you enjoy that? Oh yes. Yeah, good recommendation. Good. It's literally Those... like a deep fried sandwich. Mm -hmm. oh. And the fries were incredible. So they were indeed. thank you, Disney Kate. Yeah, for thanks, that. Disney Kate. I've been literally. I think she came here in like 2018 or 19, and I've wanted to try it and ever since still then. Here as well. <laughs> yeah, no, that went down an absolute treat. Mm -hmm. I'm glad we shared as well. Yeah, look, it's so much. Well, I think it's better to share because now we can go off and have. <laughs> some more snacks and more food and snacks and <laughs> doll whips and all. Uh... So after that delicious sandwich. The duck cracking me up here. Oh, they always dive in underwater. With their bones sticking out. Oh. Great. But yeah, so after, after the sandwich, we are now heading towards the Matterhorn. Really looking forward to this ride. Oh, and the parade's on. We'll do the 5.30 one. Yeah, we've missed the, is that the three o'clock one now? 
Seeing this carousel just reminds me of Walt Disney and um, there's a video of him going around it. So we just got the Matterhorn. I didn't realise wow. how wet you get on that ride. Like I there know. was a bit at the end of it where it's like a log flume where you actually go through the got water. So I was got, I got really really wet. But and I, bone shaken. I no, I liked it. I didn't think it was that bad. I thought it was quite bad. Did you? Yeah. No, I didn't think it was that bad. I was all over the place, but I was, I wasn't really holding on. No, see, I was holding on with yeah. both hands. Yeah, I was. <laughs> I had the camera in one hand, and my other hand was holding my bag because I didn't want my bag to fly away. But no, we're having literally the best day. We've just been like trying to wander around and take it all in as well. Like, just because. Oh, yeah, it's great. Absolutely. And, and I don't know, I just. It's just got a really chilled vibe. It has, it's like, definitely more chilled than um, Magic Kingdom in Florida. Yeah, I just feel like everyone's. No one here feels like they're in a rush. No, it's all just laid back, chilled out, yeah. vibes nice. So I think now we're going to do the Nemo submarine and then I want to go and get a spaceboard parade. Okie dokie, we can do that. Okie dokie, Arachoki, we'll take you along with us. Deep water volcano. 
even here in the shallows, we can see evidence of such geothermal forces constantly at work. You can tell by our surroundings that they can make some pretty dramatic changes to the landscape, hidden for centuries beneath the ocean floor, hidden until unearthed by a tremendous volcanic event. The colourful reef that surrounds us is a biological community that thrives in warm, shallow waters. done the um, Finding Nemo submarine adventure. I don't know exactly what it's called. That's actually quite good. I wasn't That's... expecting it to be so long. Yeah, no, it was really good. I, like, they've done it well. Yeah, no, I thought good. Now we're just going to get a spot for the parade. Yes, as it is. Well, how long have we got? About 20 minutes of parade? Mm hmm Yeah.
we're just having a bit of a sit down and the reason yeah. the camera is so low is because the sun's right behind us so you get a massive glare <laughs> Um, but we've just come to Galaxy's Edge, having a little rest on our feet we because indeed. we were stood up for like an hour waiting for the parade and then I'll watching tell you what the though, parade. We, we're not 100% sure on this, but we think we both have never sat through a parade together. No, we like haven't. Like from start to finish, or actually even got a seat like a half hour before. I feel like because um, I'd done it so much with my family as kids, yeah. that like because I went with my family so often, we kind of stopped watching them all the time. No, fair So enough. then when I started doing my trips with you, we just weren't really watching them. No, I mean we we obviously we watched them. We would like if it was coming past, we would sit like stand watch that, there like, five and watch or ten it. minutes. Um, but we never got like a front row seat. But yeah, so I I want to do um, Rise Resistance today. No, go and do it then. I think we should do that. Because um, that's a good rush. I love that ride. We yeah. both also said we've technically park hopped now. We've left oh, Magic yeah. Kingdom and we're now in Hollywood Studios. <laughs> technically, how? <however. laughs> but yeah, we're just going to enjoy another five, ten minutes of just a little bit of downtime. People watching. That's one of the best things about being at Disney is just sitting down, with people watching, seeing all the different walks of life that walk past yeah, you. Yeah, this is true. So yeah, we'll catch you at Rise of Resistance, hopefully. Oh. <laughs> I know. It's hard not to though. Well yeah, because we're so used to that. And then you come somewhere new and they have the same thing. You're like, like even the even the line, the queue here is just the same. The only difference is that way doesn't lead you down towards Terra Terra. <laughs>
escape. You will tell me the location of the secret base, and then I will destroy you and your resistance. outside the wreck. Yeah, if you know us already, we are a sucker for Monto wraps. Mm. It's just too good. I still want to try and recreate these at home. It is too good. Yeah, we're just having such a chill one at the moment. I mean, we, we don't really want to do anything else now until, until the fireworks. There's still a few things we've got to do in the park, but we want to save that for Sunday. Like we haven't been to Toontown, like Mickey and Minnie's run away, we're away. We haven't really explored Fantasyland. Um, yeah. So we're going to save all that for Sunday. So we're just going to have this dinner now. Got to go a look at the shops on Main Street and then get ourselves a spot for fireworks. Also, you can't get Ronto wraps in Docky Bay 7. Which we found out the hard way, which <laughs> you can do in Disney World. Yeah, so we queued up, ready to get them, and they said, oh no, you have to get them from, what's that place called there behind us? Ronto Roosters. Ronto Roosters. Roasters. Yeah, roasters. I'm sure it's Roasters. You love to support things your own bit in their own names. I give most things my own my own name. Like yeah. all days and call it Toontown, Toonville. Tooneyville. That was it, Tooneyville, not even Toon. <laughs> I feel like I need a new rain mat for my walks at home. I wouldn't lose ya. Yeah. <laughs> stitch bags. I wanna get her one. But I feel like I'd rather her choose one in Florida. If you're watching this, Emily, you can choose one in Florida because they've got so many. I wouldn't want to buy you, buy you the wrong one. So I wouldn't wear it, but I do like it. Yeah? Mm. I'll go with the rest of them in your wardrobe. Why would it be good for Jason? Oh, you could put all, all of Emily's things in there. All of his work stuff. <laughs> no, it's all Emily's things for Florida. I need to choose one. What one would she want? Stitch is. Stitch. Trousers. That feels weird. Yeah, same as this. Like a stretchy. It's like a funky material. Yeah. And then they've got another stitch bag. 
What, when did Stitch become so popular again? Yeah, we was having this conversation like a few months ago. Like, Stitch is an old film. Yeah. And then all of a sudden it's just blown back up. And that's where Walt used to spend his time up there, didn't he? So that's where Walt used to spend his, mm -hmm. his time, used to wake up, come down, have a <laughs> breakfast on Main Street. We're going and doing that on Sunday? We are indeed. We were just stood in the um, fire department, which is underneath Walt's apartment, and we just said to each other, like, Walt's been in this room. Like, he used to sleep upstairs. That's actually mad. It's mad to think. They were incredible actually and it's, it was such a different show to Magic Kingdom, you can't even compare the two, it was it was just amazing in its own way. Yeah, it definitely was. And like the um, Up House. Yeah, was and instead, not of, instead of Tinkerbell they had the Up House come flying along, it was just incredible. And obviously as always it's absolutely manic <laughs> leaving Main Street. So. We forgot how bad it was. <laughs> So we've just come and we're sitting outside the entrance to the railway and, well the railroad, and yeah, we're just taking it all in a little bit. Taking and in, watching the crowds leave and then once they die down a bit we will head off ourselves. Head up, yeah. So that is the end of today's vlog, a yeah. very busy day for us. Extremely busy day. We've been out for like 14, 15 hours. Like, 20,000 steps, feet are killing, but it's been absolutely incredible. I like, absolutely love Disneyland. Yeah, 100%. And yeah, I would recommend anybody to come here. If you're a Disney fan, then this is definitely something you, you'll, you'll love. So thank you so much for watching. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you on next week's vlog. <laughs>